Hey all, welcome back to some Stellaris playing as the Cardassians for a couple more days! Um, what do we got going on? Last episode was mostly us sort of colonizing and grabbing things that we um, wanted to grab. And now... Now... Now we're gonna kill them. So... <laughs> Station complete. Let's come over here. Let's go over there again. Let's get you... Come over here. You should get, do we have a general that we can grab? Recruit. Recruit me a general. Um. You. Affirmative. Be my general. My general leader person. Um. Obviously, what we're doing is we're going to declare war here. Take as much as we can to grow this area. Pacifica over here is a little meh, but we want Epsilon City and we want Forkas. Um. It'll be glorious. <laughs> There's so many protectorates under United Earth. That's all they do, apparently. Free states of Orion, our vassals. Yeah. So once our troops our, our get down there, because our damn empire is too large at this point. Um, energy credits, isolinear computers. It's probably better to do one. Oh, like. Let's do that. Better reactor. All right, we're going for the Xenomorphs, too. Just because that seems safe in every way. <laughs> Xenocav. The Xenocav are something where, like, you can upgrade your army. I forget. There's a way to do that, right? Failing at clicking. Station complete. But, like, you, I can give you an attachment. So I could give you all these various things. Extra damage, lower upkeep. I really don't ever do that because I feel like this is... And you can assign individual leaders to an individual unit, which seems excessive, right? Because you're so gapped in how many you can have. I think it's an interesting design decision that they would even consider that. Um, I don't know why they did. I really don't. Let's give you a customs office. Let's upgrade both of these. I need to build something here. So... Um, I guess you could, I mean, there's ways to, I don't know, it seems a silly thing to do. That's what I have to say. Where are you now? I was going to say, that's not a logical place for you to be. Um, we would like to put a war on you. We would like to seed planet Epsilon Seti and fork us. Um, okay, well, I apparently can't get you that way, so let's see here. Declare war, we would like... I don't even know where the hell that is. Um, seriously, where is it? Is it up here? 15 Lin Lin Signet? That's the only planet I see. Let's have you see both of them. Um, let's move you there. Apparently we lost our army. Which we're going to lose for another half a month. Interesting. I guess you can just come here. Yeah, I didn't think you'd have much in the way of defenses here. Doesn't seem likely. We'll deal with the rest of you in a little bit. I'm so confused. Um, Interstellar Railroad! We lost one enslaved pop. Perfectly fine. I feel bad about the slavery anyway. Okay, there we go. You guys 
land armies. I just don't know why I would... Like, the, the amount of micromanaging of the armies, then, is just ridiculous, if you would want to do it that way. Um, this should be a nice, easy run all of them through very quickly. Alright. Ah! Enemy invasion defeated. Wait, what just happened? Wait, wait, what? Okay, we have too many colonized systems, so I just got those two systems. That's okay. They gave us planets. The Cadian Union's now our vassal? Was that... The, wait, what? I have a vet. Wait, what just happened? The Canadian Union doesn't exist. Did they join and then immediately go away? Is that what just happened? Did I like. Were these guys the Canadian Union? Is the... Ah. See? Now I understand. Okay. So the first thing's first. First thing we're going to do is take. This area. Tell a drill. Give you that. And that. Ensure that. And hit close. Alright, so that's one. You are going to have to become your own sector, because I'm never going to get over there. Um, and you can have those two things. We'll hit close. Let's get our construction ships over here. We'll do that. Are you constructed over here? You are. Oops, that's what I wanted to do. Um, seriously. Let's grab you and bring you back over to like here and then you can end. you know what we have to go somewhere I think we control go over there that's fine um you probably have a way to automatically explore good well we've, we, we knocked out the Tamarians apparently whoops enemy vessels detected spatial risk detected um or, I guess, the Tamarian still exist somewhere? If they do, I don't know where. I'm confused by that. The Bullion League is just confused. They're all over the damn place. Ships are getting back to where they need to be, which will be good. All right, let's go back to our planets now that we've successfully done what we needed to do. You can be upgraded. All the upgrades. Um, let's see, what should we build for you? Not ideal. Mine on the Gaia world. It'll be fine. Oh, this is the Tamarian Republic. Apparently all they've done is just like, we're going to protect everyone. 
There's two different Tholian groups. Confederation and the Confederacy. Hmm. We should probably upgrade our ships. Or maybe not. I don't think we've done... Range of 30, range of 100. No, this is just play better. Okay, so close in. Stuff needs Research to complete. be upgraded, so you too. Um, good. Got a whole bunch of salt hollows. We just the shield and stuff. Ooh. Um, we need to get you into orbit. And we'll upgrade you because we can. Always okay to upgrade. I feel like that's just an always a good answer. I don't know. I really am debating. Klingons, Romulans next. Ships upgraded. Ships Station upgraded. complete. And we are getting energy again. That's good. Let's look at our mineral gifting options. Research complete. Long range scan of planet complete. Um. You, I just, your taxes are high, but you're awesome, so. Jeez Louise. Everyone wants a little bit of something. <laughs> torpedoes, 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 and torpedoes. <laughs> You know, you have great Game of Thrones. I'm going to call this Game of Torpedoes. It's very famous. Um, yeah. I don't know this one. Lorian League. I was just staring, I was staring at the map. I mean, the map's very pretty. We've got a lot of stuff going on. Um, is there a way to hide... We'll do that, which is <laughs> opinion map mode. Everyone hates me. Literally, everyone hates me. Uh, <laughs> that's okay. And then. Here, let's let's find you. Can I talk to you? Do you want to be vassalized yet? No, because you're too big. I've continued to increase my power. Apparently, that's not not enough for you. In the meanwhile, let's do that. God, we produce so many minerals. It's awesome. Love it. I need, like, go faster speed. Because <laughs> yeah, the reality here is that we don't... I don't have a lot of targets that aren't in some of sort of crazy alliance or protectorated in some way that I don't think I can handle. The Celestial League. The Romulans, right? Okay. Um. Do that for me and then build up more. And then I guess. Hmm, this actually might be the right place to put the um. Station complete. I guess we don't have that option. Okay, sorry. 
You are building ships right now? You are. That's good. Let's get you building another one. Um, just a cruiser for now. But we'll increase our power. If I were the Ferengi, I'd be wanting to like blow this up so much. I also need to know how they have so many systems. Look how many systems they control. Is there a Ferengi thing about that that I don't know about? In general, that's one thing that kind of frustrates me is that I... I only have five. Like, I know the Federation can grow dramatically, but I guess they... I guess what we're not seeing is they probably have sectors. They have sector divisions there. But I would just... I just want to control everything. Let me control. <laughs> I want to be in control. Affirmative. Um. Station complete. Who have ever felt this deep? Oh! I completely forgot. So, big news of the day... Um, the big news of the day is that there is a new expansion announced for Stellaris called Stellaris Utopia. Uh, big expansion. I think it's the first big expansion. DLC, it's going to cost $20 is, the, is what people are guessing. I think there may have been a Steam page already. I'm not sure. Um, I'm going to add a lot of things, including Dyson Spheres and Ring Worlds and stuff that you can build. Um, and then I think the other big thing is Habitats. And some uh, Empire advancement mechanics that are new. So you'll be able to, like, get points for different things. I don't I'm actually... Now that I'm talking about this, I'm not even sure exactly um, what it does. Um, I was like, wait a minute, what is the thing it does? The, 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 the advancement with the thingies and the stuff. Um, and I can't remember. So that's a terrible thing for me to do. You really are kind of at a loss for what to do right now. I mean, in some ways this game has run its course. I didn't do a good enough job of... Ugh, excuse me. Pushing really hard on... You know, where to break the other alliances, basically. And in the end, that's hurt us a lot. Um, but it's okay. It's fine. Uh, I think I think we learned a lot about the Cardassians. There's some cool mechanics. I love the graphics, so that's always good. Traditions. Traditions is what I was trying to figure out. So they'll, you'll get unity points and adopt the ideas and bonuses that will ease your species' expansion across the guest stars, unlocking special perks for completing a set. So I have no idea what that is. Um, and you can also set specific policies by race. So you, we could, like, allow the Folians to be part of us, but the Bajorans to not be, that kind of thing. Which I think is, that, that makes a little bit more sense, I think. Um, certainly if you want to do that, you definitely can. And that's a, that's a, that'll be good. Um, so I appreciate that. Oh gosh, so many things we can build here. Completely was failing at that. Um, sure, I'll research it. So I'm kind of shocked there's still an anomaly to be found at all. Um... So many things we can build right now. It's kind of good. There you go. Your unit upgrades. Boom. Upgrade the Royal Gardens into something nicer. Yeah, we spent a lot, a lot of influence right now, but that's okay. That's fine. Um, so we got. Okay, that's, yeah, not exciting. Not exciting. So Tamarians, I feel bad about almost, but whatever. Whatever. Research complete. House of Drax. Let's see, we got those crops, so I kept them, like, staring at them, so I was confused by them. Um, extra edicts. Station Duration. Complete. We'll grab the food application, because we've been ignoring it. All right, we're going to call an end to this here. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Excited for the new expansion. Excited to figure out who we're going to play next. I'm still debating, but we'll see. Kind of want to play with Birds of Prey, so it's Klingon and Romulan. We'll see what it is, but see you next time. Bye-bye.